So to edit display settings, you just right click and then go personalize. Now um, on Windows XP, it will say uh, properties, properties, but uh, on Windows Vista and 7, it'll say personalize. Now um, then you can go desktop background and you can like choose what picture you want. Uh, if you go Windows Color, you can like change how everything, like all the colors and stuff. And you can go screensaver, and you can like change the screensaver there, and you can also change it to like other theme things so I got it on Windows Aero here it's like cooler than Windows 7 basic so it's got like the buttons up here uh, like nice and like like there that is cool whereas I can change it to Windows 7 basic by coming in here clicking on basic and high contrast themes clicking Windows 7 basic and then it'll like be changing it over and it sometimes takes a few seconds but yeah you notice now the buttons I don't like those buttons as much but um the buttons have changed and it goes and minimizes different and so if I was to get like a Windows Explorer window open and then I was to go and get another one I'd have two here, and when I hover over it here, it comes up like this, so it doesn't do it like the arrow where it's got two boxes side by side, like that, it's got them like rows. Um, you can also change it to Windows Classic, so like the old Windows 95 or Windows... Uh, XP can have as well and it changes it like this so yeah it's not as cool but yeah uh, and yeah it's like all old how the old one was it's got the old boxes and yeah, the old windows and stuff. But yeah, I prefer the Windows Arrow one, well, that's my favourite. And yeah. So um if you have any questions, just send me an email or ask me on my website. Oh yeah, and if you switch back from like Windows Classic, you notice how with Windows Classic the background went back pale blue. Well, if you swap it back, it'll take you to the default Windows uh, Seven background, which is this one, which is kind of cool. But then, like, yeah, you have to go through and change it. But I'd have to come back in here and just click on my theme that I had. Um. And yeah, so it puts it in like that, and so it's still Windows Aero. Uh, and yeah, so if you've got any questions, just send me an email or contact me. Thanks for watching.